Hey guys, Sarah here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing a nail polish declutter. This is my very first declutter video. I just think that it is so important to only have products in your collection that you use. And I have been doing such a bad job at that as far as my beauty products go. I have totally curated my closet and I cycle things in and out of my closet all the time. But for some reason, I just have been hoarding beauty products. So today I'm going to be decluttering this is my current nail polish collection i have like i think 150 bottles i don't know we will count them um but yeah i want to get it down to like 20 16 i don't know we'll see how far we get but yeah if you're interested in that keep watching and if you're new here don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you don't miss any of my future videos all right let's get into it okay so this is the first batch i'll just pull from here when i need more and then i'm going to set the ones that i'm going to declutter to the side so there's some that I know right off the bat that I'll get rid of, and those are brands besides Kale Polish, the Essie Gel Couture, or OPI. Those are the only ones I've bought recently, so if it isn't one of those brands, I'm going to get rid of it. So these Orly ones, this one was made for me. Um, this is Finger Paints, which is a brand that is sold at Sally Hansen. Um, and then the old, the regular Essie formula, I don't like the brush for these, so I don't wear that. This is the um, Gel Shine from Sally Hansen. I didn't like that. Um, some of these shades are just not my cup of tea anymore, and I just don't wear them more orally. Um, shimmer shades, I'm probably going to keep one shimmer shade, which actually I'll leave this one to the side, and then I'll decide between them. So the other shimmers I'll just get rid of. I'm probably going to keep one or two like dark maroony shades, so I'm going to leave that to the side as well. I think this is, yeah, Lincoln Park After Dark. I'm for sure keeping this one, so I'll put that to a different pile. Some blues I don't want. This olive green I haven't worn. This one from Kale Polish. I love the formula and the brush, but I just didn't like this shade. It's too dark chocolatey for me. I don't know what I was thinking. Light purple, I'm not into that. I don't like red polish. Um, I have not ever worn this shade. It looks bad on my skin tone. I'm probably going to keep one or two of these like taupey shades. So I'm going to put these to the side. This one, I think, um, yeah, I'm not about you. I'm for sure going to keep this one. Um, this is strawberry margarita. I really like this one. I'm tan. So I'm going to keep this one. This is, I eat mainly lobster. This is going to be a maybe. I think this one is elephantastic pink. Yes, it is. So this I'm going to keep for sure. This I'll put in the dark maybe pile. This I'm going to let go. This I think is Patience Pays Off. Yep, I'm going to for sure keep that. This I'm going to pass on. This is Alpine Snow. It's like a white that I don't wear. Um, pass that on. This one has like an iridescence that I just, I'm not the biggest fan of it. It's Japanese, Japanese Rose Garden. I'm just not the biggest fan. Um, this is too brown for me. I'm going to leave this in. I might do like a cool tone neutral as well. This I haven't worn in forever. This clear, the found, or the formula is just totally messed up. And I haven't worn this shade in a long time either. So, I just got rid of a lot. I have a few maybes and I have five that are yeses. So let's move on. Ooh, yeah, let's move on to the next batch. Let's see if I can just pick out of here ones that I'm for sure going to pass on. These I'm going to pass on. This is an old Essie. This is China Glaze. Um, and then I'll just kind of put them down here as well. This blue I'm never going to wear. Same as this or this bright orange or this red. This is a glitter. I'll put this in the maybe glitter pile. This is a glitter. I'll probably keep a glitter that is more neutral. I think this is warm me up. Yes, it is. I'm going to for sure keep this one. This one too. I love this shade. It is Defy Explanation. Um, I'm going to pass this on. Yeah, I got a date. This has got a date tonight. I am going to put this in the maybe pile. This is um, sleigh parking only. Pass this on. I'm going to pass this orally on. This is pink flamenco. I'm going to maybe pile this one and that's very daring this is one of my favorites i'm for sure keeping this one this i'm going to put into the maroon maybe pile 
These ones I'm going to pass on. This I think has got myself into a jambalaya. Yep, I want to keep that. I'm going to pass these on. This is what I'm wearing right now. It is um, Matter of Fiction from the Gel Couture line. The Gel Couture line is my favorite right now. I'm absolutely obsessed, so I'm for sure keeping this. I'm going to pass this on and this. This can be one of my maybes for the glitter shade. Pass this on. This is too red for me. These are too orange. Anything that's, like I said, not SE or OPI means it's probably old and would need to be passed on anyway. This is another one I've been wearing a ton too. This is also from the Gel Couture line. It's Couture Curator and I'm obsessed with it, so I'll keep that one. I actually think it's, oh, I guess it's not that similar. It's a little bit more pinky than the Got Myself Into a Jambalaya. This will be a maybe glitter. I'm gonna pass these on. Um, I'll maybe this one, pass this one on. Let's Be Friends is such a classic. Um, I'm gonna maybe this one. This, these will go, this one, ooh, this is It's Pink PM. I love this one. But I, I don't wanna keep too many of the pinks, so I'll just leave that here. OPI scores a goal is another fave. I'm gonna put this in the pile so I don't keep too many of these dark maroon shades. This one is Elephantastic Pink. I thought I had, oh, I think this one is empty. Maybe. Yeah, this one is empty, so I'm gonna pass this on. More S old Essie, old Orly. Another brand that I got a long time ago. Okay, let's dump these. Okay, so let's see. Two orange, two red, two green, two red, two purple. Old, old. Formula's messed up. This one looks like it's pretty tame, but it's actually like almost fluorescent-y in the light, in the sun. I'll put this in the maybe glitter pile. I'm gonna pass this on. This one is old. This one I love, Live Love Carnival, maybe. This I'm gonna pass on. This is terracotta something, in familiar territory. I'm gonna pass that on. I never wear any of these ones. Or these, what's this? This one is so popular, it's Funny Bunny, and I just feel like I don't get a fully opaque coat of it, no matter how many coats I do, so I'm gonna pass this on. I'm gonna pass these on. Um, I'm gonna pass this on. This one is old. Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna pass these ones on. Yeah, because I already have enough of the dark red ones, and these ones aren't as flattering on my skin tone. Um, okay. This is Susie Hops and Island Chops. I thought I was going to love this, but this doesn't look good on my skin tone either. And then in the Cable Car Bowling, I feel like I already had one of these. I don't know. Okay, so between these ones, I think that this one, OPI Scores of Goal, is a little bit more brown, so I'm for sure gonna keep this one. And then this one is dark. Oh. What is... Okay, let's see. I really love both of these ones, but I only... Okay, I'm not gonna keep this one. This is in the Cable Carpool Lane. I'm going to keep, <sighs> okay, I'm for sure keeping this one. I think I'm going to keep both of these because I do really love both of them. I know they're pretty similar, but I just can't say no to either of them at the moment. And then I think I'm going to keep this one, which this one's Miss O'Leary's barbecue sauce. I really love this shade, but I think I'm going to keep Just Be Claws. Okay. And then for this one, I actually think that I am going to 
keep this for now it's pink flamenco and see if i really like it once i have a tan this summer because it's hard to tell when your skin is so fair but i get really tan in the summer so it looks bad on me right now but i want to see i'll test it out in the summer if i still don't wear it i will pass it on okay four glitters um i th think that i am going to keep I think I'm gonna keep this one. This is Silent Stars Go By. So I'm gonna keep this as my glitter so I will get rid of these other four. Okay, and then I'm gonna keep this one for now. As far as these ones go, these are the light shades I have. I'm keeping this for sure. This one is more, it's not as pinky, so I'm for sure gonna keep this one. And then I think between It's Pink PM and Let's Be Friends, I'm gonna keep, keep, keep I'm going to keep It's Pink PM because it's newer and this one is almost gone. So I'll just pass this one on. Oh, I have this one too. This is Mod About You. This one is a little bit of a different pink. I'm justifying right now and that's okay. All right. So then for these neutral ones, let's see. This is I saw. I saw Paulo over there and I think I want to keep this one. I wore this one a lot. Um, you don't know jocks. Oh, I really love that one too. Over the taupe is one that I used to wear a ton. I'm going to pass this one on. This is, oh, this is set in stone. I think this one is topeless. Yep. This one is topeless beach. So I'm going to pass these ones on. I'm going to keep you don't know jocks and I saw Paulo. Oh, I saw Paulo over there. I'm going to pass this one on to this is staying neutral okay what is this i eat mainly lobster i'm gonna pass this one on okay so for pinks and everything okay so as of now i have 5 7 10 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 oh my gosh okay but this is a maybe so i feel like that is pretty good i have my two um gel couture which I love both of these so much. It's Matter of Fiction and Couture Curator. So I love both of these. I have one shimmer shade, which is Silent Stars Go By. I love this one. And then for light pinky ones, I have Mod About You, Patience Pays Off, and um, It's Pink PM. I love all three of these. And then for more of like summer shades, I have Defy Explanation, that's very daring. Elephantastic Pink, Live Love Carnival, Got Myself Into a Jambalaya, I think this is strawberry margarita and pink flamenco. So these two, I are I'm gonna maybe them in case my uh, I don't like it when I'm tan, but we will see. Then I have you don't know jocks and I saw Paula over there. I'll keep both of these. And then for my darker ones, I have Lincoln Park after dark. I break for manicures, warm me up, sleigh parking only, OPI scores a goal, and just be claws. So I feel like the fact that I can name all of these no problem except for these two I had to look. I think that's pretty good. That means that I really love these all. I'm super excited to have these in my collection. So let's see. I'm keeping 21, maybe 19 depending on these two. And then let's see how many I'm getting rid of. So I have 114 here and then plus the 21 that I'm keeping. So I had 135. I don't know why that took me so long starting out. But this is what i'm donating i feel like that's really really good i'm going to research this and see if i can donate it to a women's shelter but i'm really proud of this Alrighty, guys that is everything for this video i feel like i did a pretty good job give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you don't miss any of my future videos and i will see you guys in my next one bye